Good evening, dropouts. It's Friday, and I've spent way too much time trying to film this video. I've had a long day. I woke up at 10 a.m. I wanted to film the video then because I wanted to do it while the sun was still up. But it just took too long. I couldn't find a spot to do it at, so I had to go to work in an hour. So I got dressed and went to work, and then I worked from noon to six and I tried to film the video at there after work but it was just the film it though the lighting was weird there too so I was just like you know what I'll do it when I get home I'll figure it out I got home at eight o'clock it is now ten o'clock and I just found a good spot to film it took me two hours to find a good spot to film my video isn't that ridiculous I'm in the laundry room right now. That The laundry room has the best lighting for for filming. Isn't that, that's ridiculous. Jeff, you met JK Rowling. That is so amazing. You got her signature, you looked at her, you touched her. I'm so jealous. Um, that's so cool. And I cannot wait to see more videos from you because I saw your Pellegrino video back in April. It was really funny. I really loved it. Jenny. You are right. You are so fun. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. And I'm so glad that you said yes to this project. I'm so excited. So excited. Miriam, break a leg on your uh, audition. I'm not sure when it is. I don't remember. That's... I'm, I'm stupid. I just... I didn't go back to watch it, but whenever it is, break a leg. Uh, Mallory, I'm trying so hard not to get punished right now. You don't even you don't even understand because your rules video yesterday scared the crap out of me. You look like you you look like you're just itching to punish somebody. You're just like I'm gonna ooh, mm, I'm trying to avoid it so bad. So if this if this goes up past midnight, do not punish me. This whole day was a punishment. Okay, please, please, just please. Mikey, I'm so glad that you got your video up. Uh, even if it wasn't on Saturday, you still got it up, and I'm really, really, really happy. Jeff and Miriam both did uh, favorite things se uh, segments in their video, and it was really, really interesting. So they got me one to do it too. So I'm going to show you a uh, few of my favorite things. Thing one, this is my plant that I. Uh, this is a plant prop from A Raisin in the Sun, a play that I was in in 2007, my senior year in high school. And um, my character tended for this plant through the entire show, and it's a symbol, and it's gorgeous, and I love it. So I asked the director if I could have it, and she said yes. So I got everybody in the cast and crew to sign it, and I love it. I love it. I will keep this forever. My Slytherin scarf. I knitted this myself, um, April, May, sometime in 2008, and it took me 20 days took me 20 days to knit this. It uh, would have taken 14, but my fingers were swelling. Like, I was knitting non-stop, like three hours a day, four hours a day. I wanted this scarf bad. So yeah, I learned, to, I learned to knit in like two days. And then after that, I knit this one. This is a Ravenclaw scarf. I knit it for my friend Amanda. It's not done yet, but it's. Uh, I just have to add fringe, but yeah. That's another one of my favorite things. Uh, acting award that I won my senior year of high school. This one is for Alice in Wonderland. I played the mock turtle. I think I have pictures of it, so I'll put those up. Uh, this is another acting award that I won the same year. Like I won Best Supporting Actress for Alice in Wonderland, and I best and I won Best Lead for A Raisin in the Sun. This is the second award. I really wasn't expecting that. That was a huge surprise. I was like, oh my god. Not, nobody had ever done that before, so it was a big honor. I was really surprised. And my last favorite thing is... Frederick Douglass! Yay! Frederick Douglass is my guitar. I bought him on November 26, 2008, and I named him on December 29, 2008. My friend David actually named him and it's not really an inside joke it's sort of uh you have to be there for it not to be offensive joke sort of like that but uh yeah and before i forget random fact did you know that on january 9th severus snape was born 
And guess who else was born? Imelda Staunton. Imelda Staunton. Random fact. Mikey, I'll see you tomorrow.